In their petition, the group alleged that some senior leaders are allocating land to people from outside the Bakwangali community without following the right or legal procedures. The group claims that the illegal allocation of land is forcing some residents to being forcefully removed from their land. This situation, which started in 2017, the group says, was reported to the Anti-Corruption Commission, but they were advised to first take it up with the traditional authority and the Kavango West Regional Council. Such attempts to resolve the matter, the group said, fail. Hence, calling on the Minister of Agriculture, Water and Land Reform and the President to intervene. For a long time, been experiencing and requesting them to investigate in order to find a solution to the matter of illegal and uh, grabbing of land as well as fencing. But nothing has been done in as far as we speak, which means that they too condone and authorize these illegal activities by the Ukwangali traditional authority. The group demands the following. All illegal fences to be removed as soon as possible. Number two, Kavango West Regional Council have received these grievances, but nothing has been done. They need to act now. Office of the Ukwangali Traditional Authority at Kahenge to be closed immediately, immediately to allow the Anti-Corruption Commission to investigate the Office for Corrupt Activities. Their petition was handed over to the Kavango West Regional Council's office. Contacted for comment, the chairperson of the Ukwangali Traditional Authority, Hamonera Hambioka, noted that their office is not aware of the allegations and urged the community to report illegal activities to the Traditional Authority's office. Hamonera was, however, quick to state that the same community members who are demonstrating are the ones illegally giving grazing land to people who are not from the area without informing the traditional authority. Julia Nafuka, NBC News, Siraro Village, Kavango West Region.